welcome back to my YouTube channel at Amos Official TV and Tehi. So guys, my name is Tehi. Na leo tuna waletea ile story mnasikia kwa mitandao pipeline, eh, kuna ghost pipeline. So leo tungechaka tuwalike guest eh, atuambie hii story ni ya ukweli ama ni ya uongo. Yeye mwenyewe amejionea, huyu mwanadada amejionea mambo mengi. Sisi tumekuwa tukidhani ni story ya jaba lakini tunataka atupe ukweli wa hiyo story. Mambo kwa waacha nani? Sarenge. Sarenge. Sasa Sarenge ningetaka utuelezee history ya ghost ya pipeline yenye inatembea huku mtaani. Ah uh, it's a true story na nasema hivyo kwanza. Mhm. Mm Unaweza ongeza sauti kiasi. <coughs> okay, it's a true story. Mhm. Mm Nimeisikia kwanza kwa my friend. Mhm. Mm ya mwenye tuna stay na eh. So alika kwa nyumba akaniambia eh usiki kuna gym tumekam na basically all of a sudden ameita mtoto mmoja akampeleka rooftop kwa building na akamrusha na aliona mtu akirushwa so nikamwambia aha nikacheka ngabeyo ni uongo kuna kitu gani hiyo by the hizo ni kwa movie that's what we know but today it was the day manze okay so ukisema ulikuwa umemjua na nani na na rafiki yako alikuwa amekuelezea story so hii story tumesikia kwa sababu kwa mtandao kuna watu wamesikia hii story na wanachiuliza kama hii story ni kweli ama pana that's why tumekuja kutafuta ili ukaelezee wale wanawatafama wajue hii story inaendeleaje wewe kwanza ni mkazi wa pipeline yeah mimi ni mkazi wa pipeline okay but mimi ni mgeni huko so hii story vinye tunasikia kwamba kuna mtoto wa ningatwa wewe mwenyewe ulimuona na macho yako yeah, because uh, <coughs> I'll come back when I'm in Yeah, so I'm not sure if you to do it. So, like, if you took it, you took it, so tension mob, no, just mini, no, just when you are mini, because it can be trend by the way, but I took it a mile. So, eh, mini, I took it as a boy, Nicole, like, Nini and the So, yeye ni true story ni kitu nimeambia. Watu kama mse una watch man the big that true story. Na sasa vile uliona hiyo ghost imemnga imemngata huyo mtoto. Ilikuja kama mtu ama ilikuja kama shetani, ilikuja kivipi? Okay, hiyo ghost hata uwezi explain cause first of all ikikuja kama mtu. Mhm. Yeah. Ili kuja like design ya upepo pepo hivi. Uwezi ataelezea ni nini ni kitu gani ama ni nini uwezi. So wewe huyo mtoto ulimuona venye alingatwa kuna place yenye mliona kama labda akapelekwa hosi ama akafanya nini asura jo huku watu wapitwagi so like kitu venye tili happen venye watu waliona flow ya damu kulija mhm mm na mtu yaka kukimbizo mission fair mm -hmm. so after that nasikia mimi nikaenda job cause nilikuwa nachelewa kazi mhm mm then nimeshtuka ni kwa like nini naendelea so kutoka hapo nikasikia sije metolo yako akapelekwa mama lucy mm -hmm. So kwanza hapo tujini nime happen. Okay. So tuseme yule mama yake unamjua we ukimuona unamjua ama unaweza jua anakaa wapi ama wanaishi este hapa pipeline side kan. Siji ni kama ni unaweza patana tu na mtu kwa barabara mtikendea tu ni mtu siji kabisa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So hii story kwa sababu umesema kwamba kuna wale watu wanasema hii story juu tumeisikia kwa muda. Watu wengi wanasema nini kuhusu hiyo story? Okay, kuna wale wanaamini. Wale wale wenye ambao wameona wanaamini. Mm. But wale kuna wale wanasema mpaka tuone ndio tuamini. Mm. So mix ni nasema usiwe sema eti mpaka uone ndio uamini. Mm. Ukiambiwa kitu uamini because kuna wale wenye ambao wameshuhudia. Mm. Eh yeah, si mimi peke yangu ni watu wengi walishuhudia. Okay. Yeah. Amo kun eh, jana ni nisikia mimi naishi maeneo ya nene hiyo sauti ya chini mm -hmm. kwa red so jana nimesikia hiyo pepo ilimeenda shule fulani sasa itaje hiyo shule ikageuka ikakuwa shosh ilienda kama shosh kiasi kiasi ikageuka ikakuwa mwanafunzi sasa akaulizwa na walimu eh, uko class na unasomea hapa unasomea nini eh hivyo sasa vile aliulizwa hivyo hiyo jini ikapotea tena so i think naweza sema hii ni kitu ina happen sana na watu kwa wenye wajui na kwa wenye yani hawajaweza kufikia na hii habari mm. wanaona ni kama story ya jaba yeah, but mimi yeah. kitu naweza waambia mm. hii ni story ya ukweli mm. na ukiwa na mtoto pale 
mtake care take care mtoto wako mali anaenda kucheza mwangalie juu hii dini ni kitu inaenda kwa plot inaingia kwa plot anaanza kucheza na watoto alafu anarusha huyo mtu anachukua watoto anarusha chini unaona okay hapo uh, kwa kuteke huwezi sema tuteke ovyo kid kwa sababu ukisema uteke ovyo kid kama alikuwa na mama yake so mama yake angemprotect aje so trust me what i can only say it's only for us that's all kwa sababu siti okay umesikia hiyo bado mimi nimesikia nyingine sijali yeah. disappear na watoto watatu wamerudi bila simu ya siri mm-hmm. so unaona wakarudi pia wakiwa bila bila nguo so history yenye ina iko complicated story yani yenye inahitaji prayers prayers not at taking care that mm-hmm. won't help because mm-hmm. kia mko na mama yake mama yake yeah. angemsaidia azi angejeje kuna kitu kitakuja na na ina attack only kids na huyo mtoto alingatwa ni mtoto wa shule yeah alikuwa anapelekwa shule so hata venye ume mention because kuna pale watu labda viewers walikuwa wanachiuliza yeah. hata mimi nilikuwa na question yangu nachiuliza mm-hmm. tulikuwa tunaulizana tunasema is it only that ina attack watoto peke yake kama mtu yote mwenye anapita kama mtu mkubwa okay recent cases ni kids ni yeah, watoto hai ya okay venye naweza sema i think mission yake ni kids only okay yeah. so watu wakubwa wakiwa pale wasikuwa na wasiwasi yeah, wasikuwa na wasiwasi Okay. I, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Let me not say us going us because mm. you never know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Na labda kuna wale watu wana watch na wanataka kutasama wana. Unaambiaje kuna wale watu wenye saa hizo wanasema hawezi kuja pipeline kwa sababu ya hiyo story. Unaweza waambiaje wale watu wana watch? Okay, mimi naweza waambia. Ghost inaweza ndama alipopote. Huwezi <laughs> sema huwezi kuja pipeline. Inaweza hata kupata kwenye huko. Mm-hmm. So like Never fear anything that's what I can say if you have faith and if you believe in God mm. that's all what I can say kwa sababu ukisema huwezi kuja pipeline mm. then what if kujie mali uko <laughs> Okay so na kuna swali lingine niko nalo uh-huh. wewe personal hii story inaweza kuwa imekuwa affect ama inafanya aje kwa nyumba yeah, labda kama umepaki peke yako inakuwa affect aje Wait me can't even stay alone that's that from there <laughs> Mm. Kwa hiyo tense kwenda kwa nyumba uko like eh ulale usiku ama ujie wewe. Mm. So eh manzi ni tension kwanza morning. Yeah. Adi actually was saying adi ku work but akili yangu yote iko tu incident may happen. Adi watu wakiingia job unasikia mtu anasema oh hii may happen hivi na hivi hata mimi nimeona nilikuwa hapo. Yeah. Ma customer wale kwa nani like kwa se wana kama mali nafanya job kwa like manzi nimeona. Yeah. Wengine wanakuja wanasema wanacheka wanasema ha hiyo ni uongo unaona anything hiyo ni uongo. Eh hapo sasa venye umesema kazini. Tuseme venye umefika kazini. Hakuna venye watu kazini wamekuja wakakuuliza, "Eh niache hapo kwenye mtaani wenye unakaa ni nini inaendelea ama labda kuna nini ukapata watu wanakuuliza?" Well, kwa mob. Cuz I was there but asubuhi singeza kuongea kwa hiyo kutense kushtuka. So watu ngeniuliza anything singekujibu hiyo kazini. Singekujibu kabisa. Okay. Cuz hii kama hata itaikuja kutoka kwa kile like ilikuwa asubuhi saa ngapi asubuhi nilikuwa naenda job kitu 7 hapo kwa mzee guys so ili happen that morning that time hours, yeah. morning hours yeah. na na watu walikuwa wamecha walikuja waka surround wengi ama watu hawakuja pale hiyo watu walija mm-hmm. let me tell you video ziko tiktok guys watu walija ukienda tiktok ukisearch utapata hizo video but amtoonyesho mm-hmm. mtu yama cuz unajua hiyo ilikuja ghafla so kuna mtu alikuwa na time ya ku record okay yeah so like recording ili kama time yenye watu wameja kitu cha happen mtu yeye ku see so wezi kwa loud kwenda usi to check anything okay yeah. but yeah. i believe maybe one day mama yake atakuja ku tell a story don't know ya yeah, because tulikuwa tunatafuta mama yake tu kwa sababu kuna wale watu wanataka kusikia kutoka kwa mama yake wajue nini what really happened na tulikuwa tunataka kujua tena mtoi mwenyewe anaendeleaje so the mom can't speak now so you know what's going on mm-hmm. so anahitaji time to digest all that ya juni mswake so sai guys manzeni <laughs> what do you call it like we see expect an interview from the mom so na adikila kiko tu sawa yeah so labda the kitu ya mwisho yenye unaweza ambia the viewers wale wana watch wale wana watch unaweza kuambia acha kulingana na hii story labda we encourage someone hapo juu ya mtoto hii ama the way anaweza fanya kutokana na hii story hey encourage sa i don't know what i can say me what i can say is 
don't know hata sijini malize nikisema nini like me i can say it's only prayers hakuna tiki chunga mtoto wako i don't know unaweza bibi bibi mtoto sema umemchunga like kuje tu unaweza kuja hata kama hata inzi na ifanye kile inafanya na iende yeah so easy hiyo kitu imenifanya sana nikaanza kuongoka watoto juu kuna unapita watu kwa barabara unaona mtoto ndio huyu amekimbia na kuja kuna za nini huyo hiyo jini lakini wamesema ya kwamba ya affect watu wakubwa ina affect watoto so kwa nini wewe unakuwa na na wasiwasi gosti inaweza unajua hiyo inatembelea watoto gosti inaweza unasema hivyo sasa yeye tembelea watu wakubwa so watu wakubwa takia Bye.